release readiness as we all know the cloud is constantly changing we have daily updates we have monthly updates if we look at the about section in settings and actions we can click on the version and we can click this link to learn more about this release this is a really because it gives you information on what to expect in the up and coming releases so we can go into any of the cloud services we might have access to if we look at FCCS we might want to look at what's new we've also got a new features summary as well if we look at the HTML version I can see what's new in March February and January so if we quickly have a glance at February we can see some information it recommends we join Oracle Cloud Customer Connect and then we can give feedback to Oracle relating to some of the announcements and updates as we go through you can see it's telling us specific things that have changed so for example in February we had a close manager and it was renamed to the task manager so remember your environments your test environment gets updated on the first Friday of the month production the third so you might have uh, for a couple of weeks anyway one environment let's say production still referring to close manager the test environment's been updated first and it will refer to task manager so it's important to to plan your projects and to help plan projects you really need to need to be as close as possible to the release notes of what's happening so here we can see some march details about life cycle management imports and you do need to really live in this document and and see important information so here's some really useful updates regarding metadata validations there's some information about composite forms and as we scroll down we get a little sneak preview there of the new look and feel that's coming to the uh, interface very shortly